Hey everybody, Jochen here, and today I am going to show you how to enable an excellent feature from GeForce Experience for when you do recordings with Shadowplay. And what that is, is to actually record multiple audio channels in one video file. So you can record your gameplay and have the game audio and have your personal mic audio separated so that it makes editing just so much better. Now, the first thing that you want to do is open up GeForce Experience and then go to your settings, go to general, and you'll find this setting over here, enable experimental features. As soon as you click on enable experimental features, it'll ask you to download the latest drivers and you will be getting the beta drivers. Currently the beta is on 39161. But if you look at the release highlights, this has been added in 381. Added ability to record microphone and system sound to two different audio tracks. That is a phenomenal tool to have if you're doing recording. So once that is activated, what you'd like to do is make sure that your in-game overlay is on, and then just go to your sharing, open the in-game overlay. Now, make sure that your recordings are off, and then when you go to your microphone over here, and you say settings, you will see by the power of Photoshop, ta-da, you will see a create, a single track, and a separate both tracks. So all you have to do over here is select your audio source for your microphone, and then click on separate both tracks, save it, and the next time you record, you will actually have two audio channels in your recording. To show you, I will just open up Premiere Pro, and you can see this file has been recorded and there's actually two audio channels. Now, if I find a location over here, now you'll see the top audio over here is actually the game audio, and then the bottom audio is the communications audio, which will be your mic that you selected. Let's just play this. You gotta hit the zone, mate. Oh, no. oh. Now, usually that would always be together in the same audio and you won't be able to extract the voice comms from the system sounds. But now, just to show you, I can just mute this channel with the comms on it. And instantly there's no communication happening. And vice versa, I can just keep the audio. You got, uh, I might have needed to reload before that happened. Oh. So it is a phenomenal feature. The one caveat though is that you will only be able to record your mic that you selected into the separate channel. And if you're using an application like Discord or TeamSpeak, you will still get your other players' communication coming through as system sounds. Now, if you wanna see how to fix that, I can certainly show you in the video that is currently linked above. So I hope this is a feature that you guys will be using. It is certainly one of the best features that I've seen come out of GeForce Experience in a very, very long time. Remember to like the video and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more guides like this. And if there's any other kind of guides that you would like, please drop me a comment. Thank you for watching. Yoken out.